Over the course of evolution, plants have evolved a variety of secondary plant compounds which act as chemical weapons against herbivores. In response, herbaceous insects, particularly arthropods, have evolved a variety of strategies that enable them to circumvent plant chemicals for their own defense. This chemical evolutionary arms race is thought to play a key role in driving the coevolution between plants and herbivores. This can be seen in the scarlet-bodied wasp moth. Male moths appropriate alkaloids by feeding on the dog fennel plant. The alkaloid can then be metabolically converted from one oxidation state to another to protect them from predation by golden or weaver spiders. Alkaloid-laden filaments are allocated to the flocculent, which is a cottony mass of cuticular fibers kept in the pouches on the male's abdomen. During courtship, the male will pass alkaloids to the female and her eggs. As this graph shows, male and female moths which received flocculent, experienced significantly less predation by the spider. Another way insects can avoid contact with the toxin is by suppressing the plant's defenses. This is characteristic of the corn earworm saliva, which is a glucose oxidase that decreases the level of nicotine induced in the leaves from the tobacco plant. Similarly, animals and plants have co-evolved in marine ecosystems. Marine amphipods and polychaetes can tolerate seaweed compounds that deter fishes and sea urchins, suggesting they may rely on mechanisms similar to that of insects. When offered a choice of 10 common seaweeds, polychaetes consumed more of the chemically defended seaweed than any other species, while pinfish consumed a negligible amount. The success of marine amphipods and polychaetes' ability to use seaweed secondary metabolites in deterring fishes and sea urchins suggests that their feeding characterizes strong selection for the evolution of seaweed chemical defenses and may be ecologically similar to and rely on similar detoxifying mechanisms as those used by terrestrial insects. Plants have evolved a vast diversity of toxic compounds to defend them against herbivores. In response, herbivores have developed mechanisms to overcome plant defenses.